This Friday morning, and if you take a look at the radar behind us, there's a lot of colors on it. So, uh, sure are. breaking this down, Michelle, we've got rain, ice, and snow, all sorts of things going on right now in New England. Yeah, changeable weather conditions as the day goes on. Right now, it's just rain, even all the way up through Boston. But we are going to see a change from north to south to an icy mix that will make travel tricky. I mean, the trouble is that the road crews can't pre-treat with all the rain that's coming through first thing. They'll have to wait until we make that change over to the ice. And as that happens, you're going to have a part of your morning or early afternoon, depending on your location, where it may become very slippery before those roads get treated. Our forecast then for today, rain to sleet and ice, falling temperatures and slippery, icy travel. Tonight will be drying out, but you're going to have some residual effects on the roadway. So the warm air, again, and stretches all the way up to Smithfield right now, but looking just to the north of us, the temperatures are dropping. Even in Hartford, we're down now to 37 degrees, and that falling temperature expected across our area as a cold front comes through. But we've got some heavy rainfall right now. Providence, Warwick, Fall River, up through the Boston area, numerous showers. And you can see that wintry weather stretching now into parts of Connecticut, western Massachusetts, making that change to freezing rain and sleet. And in Boston, it's going to be happening during the morning commute. So here's our cold front right now. It's going to be pushing southward over the next several hours. And that'll bring the falling temperatures. Boston's at 38. It's already in the teens in Albany and that cold air as it pushes in will make for that change over to icy conditions. This is two o'clock in the afternoon. Most of the area by that point seeing freezing rain or sleet you can see the Cape and Islands last to change that'll happen through the afternoon. So we are under this winter weather advisory starts early this morning in northern Rhode Island 10 a.m. for areas from Providence down to the coastline. So here's a look again at the timing of that change to ice 7 to 10 a.m. in the northern parts of our state. Providence down through the east and west bays through much, much of South County. It's late morning. You make it through the morning commute with just rain, but between 10 and 12, I expect those temperatures to fall to near and below freezing against the afternoon for our immediate coastline. So this is 8 o'clock in the morning, mid to upper 30s inland areas still in the 40s near the coastline, but then falling into the 30s by late in the morning as those temperatures drop. We see that change over to sleet and freezing rain. This is five o'clock in the evening. So uh, some icy conditions out there for the afternoon and evening hours before this winds down and it still has the potential to end with some snow showers. So the majority of the accumulation that we'll see for our area, unfortunately, is ice and that'll be around a tenth to a quarter of an inch of ice expected to accumulate on not only roadways, but we'll watch for power lines and trees. On top of that, could get a small coating to up to an inch of sleet. Now it all winds down overnight tonight, but dry and icy out on the roadways with temperatures at midnight around 25 and by six o'clock in the morning, we're down to about 19 degrees. Now tomorrow is going to be a blustery and cold day. Winds gusting over 20 miles per hour at times from the late morning to the afternoon. And despite the dry weather and the sunshine, it's going to feel chilly with wind chills running in the single digits in the morning and teens in the afternoon. So 40 degrees for the temperatures again this morning, but then falling from this are down to 18 tonight, 27 in the afternoon, some single digit and lower teens on Sunday morning, Sunday afternoon in the upper 20s. Monday looks dry, could see some scattered rain and snow showers on Tuesday.